Imagine somebody's sister has passed away. So you go to comfort them. You're like, don't cry because I'm here now. And I'm better than your sister. You're a rabbit. I just have naturally white hair. <laughs> How awkward. She's been rumbled. Hello everybody, it's Yami and welcome to two Get to Life mini movies. That's right, I'm reacting to two stories today. The first story we're going to watch today is called The Last Rabbit and then the second one is called His Red Eyed Bunny. I'll have the links to the original stories in the description so do make sure to go and check them out. And guys, if you're excited for Gacha today, make sure to leave a like. Let's try and hit 3000 and I'll react to some more. Now, let's get into it. Oh no, we see a bunny here with a little baby and she looks quite concerned. I see her. I'm sorry sis. Oh my she has just yeeted that child. Oh no what's happening this doesn't look very good does it? Guys another one for testing. Oh no what are they doing to the bunnies? Oh, the little baby bunny's been left on the street. It's a rabbit. Where are her parents? Honey, where are your parents? The soldier got them. I'll bring her home with me. Oh, that's so nice of her. She's brought her back. Can you show me your ears, dear? I'll go get you a change of clothes and some bandages. She's actually so cute though. I love how she's all white, but she has pink eyes. Present time. Oh, she's all grown up now. Her hair is super long as well. Daisy, come downstairs. Give me a minute. She's just gotta hide her ears so nobody knows. Ooh, she's got a disguise on. She looks more like a kitty cat now. I can't believe you're going to high school already. Remember to never take off your disguise and to stay humble and kind. Now go before you're late. Bye, mom. I love you. I love you more. Should I tell her? Maybe next time. Should she tell her what? Hmm, very suspicious. All right, we're at high school. What's going on? I think she's trying to make friends. Hi, my name is Emma. Hi, I'm Daisy. This is Lily right here. Are you a rabbit by any chance? Of course not. You kind of look like a rabbit to me. Let's change topics. Wow, her disguise worked great. So great that as soon as she walks in school, people know that she's a rabbit. Okay, time for class. Good morning, class. Today, there is a new exchange student. Come in, Daisy. I love how many exchange students from Gacha. The entire time I was at school, we didn't even have one. Hi, my name is Daisy. I hope we can all be friends. You have rabbit teeth. You're a rabbit. I just have naturally white hair. <laughs> how awkward. She's been rumbled. You still have rabbit teeth? That's because I cosplayed as a rabbit yesterday. You look pretty ugly as a wolf. Plus, all rabbits are ugly and they are for testing. So now that all of the rabbits have gone, we have amazing makeup. Enough! You're such a bad example to students, Lauren. You can take a seat beside Saren. After class. She seems so happy. I definitely would not be that happy after being in that class and being called a rabbit. My disguise has been outed and being told I look bad as a wolf. But I'm happy for her. She seems to be having fun, so that's good. So how do you like school so far? It's pretty small, which I like because I can remember where places are faster. Also, where are the boys? I only saw one. Most of them are outside or in detention. Also, there are brats here. Yeah, they're the rich people in school, AKA Lauren and Tiffany. Lauren is a literal angel, but her attitude is the opposite. Oh, she's an angel, but she's like actually a devil because she's so mean. Anyways, I'll explore more and I'll find more people. Is it just me, but like, is she so similar to a bunny? Yeah, I noticed that too, but I doubt it because all of the rabbits got extinct like 10 years ago. Yeah, poor rabbits. They had to get tested on and other stuff like that. I hope they can come back again. That's impossible, Lily. They're extinct. Oh, she doesn't look so happy now. Oops, who is this? Um, what are you doing? I just wanted to see what you were reading. Well, mind your own business. Not gonna lie, I half expected her to crash into him. And she didn't. What kind of gacha life mini movie is this? Well then, I'm very sorry for minding your business. It's no big deal. Wanna be friends? What is happening? Why is she transforming into a purple haired woman? Sorry, not yet. That's fine. Anyway, I gotta go now. See you around. I love how she's just making friends. She's so confident. 
I could never. And she's back again. The teachers are decent, and other students are nice too. Well, me and Lily have piano practice, so we better go. Bye bye! I better head home. She has a fever. I'll cook her some chicken noodle soup. Mmm, chicken noodle soup, so delicious. That looks amazing. I made you some chicken noodle soup. Thanks, darling. I also need to tell you something. Somebody knows that there is one last rabbit, which is you. Mum, what do I do? I'm scared. We have to hope that they don't tell anyone. Don't worry, Mum. Let's not think about that now. The next day. Why is there a bowl of floating chicken noodle soup? I am so confused. Teacher, wait, I can explain. You're going to the science lab. <gasps> Her ears came out. Oh wait, this is just a dream. It's all okay. She's so shook though, she thought it was real. That was so realistic. Let's hope they don't find out. Imagine that, she's just sat in class, all of a sudden, boom, her ears come out. Everyone knows. The beast drama of the year. Guys, do you like my little crown? If you like my crown, make sure to leave a like on the video. Okay, now let's get back into the gacha. Finally, I can rest before class starts. I'll just do some extra homework in the classroom. Oh no, there's a crying boy. Is he crying? Hey, do you need somebody? What's wrong with him? Poor guy. You wanna talk about it? I can't. It's fine if you don't want to talk about it. Do you promise not to tell anyone? I pinky promise. My baby sister passed away. I'm so sorry, but don't worry, I'm here. Hashtag crying party. Wait, what? Imagine somebody's sister has passed away. So you go to comfort them. You're like, don't cry because I'm here now. And I'm better than your sister. What? That's not gonna help. Now they're both crying. Why are you crying? Well, you see, I also lost my sister. She was like my mum. I'm really sorry. It's fine. Well, it's not fine though, is it? This was just so awkward. Both of them were in class just crying. Two strangers. Hey, are you okay? It's fine. Don't worry about me. She goes in there to comfort him. Then he ends up comforting her. That is not how this was meant to go. After school. Whoa, who is that girl? I love her hair. Now my head doesn't feel so itchy. Girl, what are you doing? She's literally got her bunny ears out in a class in school. Oh no. Time to put my fake ears on again. She's been spotted. This is terrible. Oh no. She's got her phone out. Say goodbye to your reputation, Daisy. I caught you. <gasps> She's going to tell everyone. She didn't, right? I gotta head home before it's too late. Yeah, you better head home. You also better head out of the country and very far away. This girl has one eye. Oh no, she's been knocked over. Who did that? She's already spreading the gossip. Her mum is not gonna be impressed. Mum, we need to move. Honey, what's wrong? I took my ears off and then somebody saw me. Was her hair purple? Yeah, why? She was the person that I said who knew that you were the last rabbit. The purple girl in your school is her daughter. She took a picture of me with my rabbit ears. What do I do? Hold on, I'm gonna do some research real quick. Okay, wonder what mum is up to. Rabbits can have an omega mode? Rabbit's omega mode happens if the rabbit is in danger or it's mad. There are many varieties of forms but this one is the most powerful. Eight out of millions of rabbits can have this. Ooh, so rabbit omega mode is super, super rare. That looks cool, but it's only 0.01%. Honey, we sadly can't move. Why not? We don't have enough money, but it's okay. You can do it. Mom, I'm scared. It's okay, you can do it. I know that you're strong. I'll try my best, I guess. The next day at school. Hey guys, stop acting, Daisy. Stop trying to hide it. We all know you're a rabbit. Just because I'm a rabbit doesn't mean I'll hurt you or anything. We don't care. Now just leave us alone. Leave us alone, cry baby. Oh my gosh, they're so mean. I thought we were real friends. What do you mean we are? But we'd never be friends with a rabbit. Yeah, I don't agree with you. Whoa, what is going on? What's your problem? You. Don't ever talk to me again. Okay, I really don't like her. She's incredibly mean. Yeah, as if I ever liked you. The drama is unreal. Oh no, she's just crashed into the purple haired girl. I'm sorry. Oh look, it's Miss Rabbit. What did I ever do to you? Why would you expose me? Because I want to. At class. All right, everyone. Sorry I'm late. All right, class. 
So I know that Daisy is a rabbit. Oh my gosh, the teacher just came out and said it. Wow, real nice. But that doesn't mean that she's any different. Okay, now it's time to start our lesson. What is going on up here? Why is the angel really mean? Oh, the rabbit's defending her. What are you gonna do, huh? What the heck? She's just transformed into an omega rabbit. That's actually kind of terrifying. Game on. Thank you so much. No worries. After an hour, the whole school knew about her form. Um, you're a monster. Can we see your wings? Okay. Oh my goodness, they're beautiful. I actually think your form and your rabbit form is cool. And I swear I wasn't on Emma's side. It's okay, but I've got to head home now. Her mom is gonna be so shook that she can transform, considering it's a 0.01% chance. Mom, guess what I found out? You sound so excited. What is it? That she can transform. That's amazing. Your form is so rare. A few months later, Daisy had the confidence to go outside with her real ear. Oh, who is that? Is it her sister? Sorry about that. Daisy? Aaliyah? You haven't grown. I still remember when you were a cute little baby. Daisy took her older sister home and her foster mom accepted her. And now nobody bothered them and they lived happily ever after. Well, that was the first story. It was so cute and her omega form was very interesting. Guys, if you thought that was interesting, make sure to hit the subscribe button. And now let's go into the second story. So we have a bunny who looks like she's asleep, standing up, casual. Oh, and she has red eyes. I can see why this story is called his red-eyed bunny. Get away, creep. She's a very, very angry bunny, isn't she? Give me my gum back. You're so nasty. That was in my mouth. Ew, she stole it right out of his mouth. So not hygienic. And I do not recommend you do that. It's and it's corona time. <laughs> Don't know why hey, that made me laugh. Oh, does a little human get flustered easily? Now get out of my face. Wow, that was a lovely first encounter, wasn't it? Wow, way to get to my soft spot, human. She wasn't any better, was she? She was actually quite rude. And it was actually kind of gross how she took that gum right out of his mouth. I have class in 15 minutes. Might as well ruin that human's day. Why is she being evil for no reason at all? What has she got? Is that a cup of coffee? Where did she even get that from? The guy's just chilling in class, talking to one of his classmates, and oh no, here comes the evil red-eyed bunny. And she's throwing the cup of coffee all over him. Why would you do that? His classmate is so shook. Are you all right, Nathan? Let me get you some towels. Why is Nathan smiling? He's just had a cup of coffee all over his shirt. It's not coming off of your shirt. And we have class in five minutes. That's okay. Go to class. I'll go wash this coffee off in the restroom. Thanks for the help though. You're welcome. I'll head to class. Stupid bunny. Got coffee all over me. Better go wash it off. Aw, look who's late to class. He's just pulled her chair from underneath her. What is going on? Why are these two people so mean to each other? Aw, look at the stupid bunny making a fool of herself. Both of you, detention now. Yeah, you guys kind of deserve that. Go to detention right now. Get that cigarette out of your mouth. So, you do care about me, huh? I didn't know that it was a lollipop. I'm not as cold as you think. Do you have any friends to hang out with here? No, I don't have friends. I'll be your friend, as long as you stop being rude to me. Okay, now Nathan will just hang out with that girl and he'll stop hanging out with me. I even dressed up nicely for him today and he still doesn't care or notice me at all. Would you like to eat lunch with me, Nathan? Sorry, I'm having lunch with Snow. Okay, sorry for bothering you two. Aw, oh, I feel kind of bad for her, but also never dress for anyone but yourself because nobody else is worth it. I'm really sorry for being rude before. I'm just really sensitive about my red eyes. I think your red eyes are really pretty. Well, uh... I'm really sorry for getting in between you and Kalini's lunch together. No, it's all right. You're really nice to talk to. Wanna hang out at the park today? Sure. So anyways, I think this boy has a crush. Maybe that's why he was being so mean. Thanks for bringing me here. It's so beautiful. 
I'm gonna call my personal photographer. Why so, Nathan? So we can take pictures in this landscape. Nathan has a personal photographer, what? Why wouldn't he just use his phone? Hello? Yeah, can you come to the park and take pictures of me and my beautiful friend? Thanks, bud. Seriously, a tripod and a self-timer would be just perfect. But now they're inviting someone to take pictures of them. Okay, are you guys ready? We'll be taking the photo in three, two, one. Looks good. I gotta get home now. My family's waiting. Bye, and thanks for helping, Tim. So nice of Tim to just leave whatever he was doing to go to the park and take a picture of these two. So spontaneous. I see you two have already met. Yes, and Snow is a really nice person. And so are you, Kalini. You're a really sweet person. I forgot. I have classes early today. I'll catch up with you guys later. Oh yeah? Guess what? Oh, they're just laughing at nothing. I think... They're in love. Oh, poor Kalini. She can hear them laughing together. I remember when Nathan used to laugh with me like that. Now we just don't talk that much anymore. I can't believe I have a crush on him. But I'll have to get over my feelings because Snow is a really nice girl. And I can tell she likes him. I don't want to take that away from her. Oh, she's actually so sweet. Oh, I almost forgot. I have to get to class early too. I'll see you later. My feelings have grown for him a lot. And I'm always positive that he likes me back. I should go confess my feelings for him. I swear they've only been talking for like two, three days. And now she's gonna ask him out. He's probably outside. Didn't he say he was going to class? And she's chasing him down. Oh my gosh, Nathan? I was not expecting that. I am shook and that's where the story has ended. Wow, two very interesting stories about bunnies and two very different plots. Guys, if you did enjoy these gacha stories today, make sure to leave a like. And if you want to watch any more content from me, you can click here and let's go watch it together.